Good friends, I hope you are going to uh, a very good resting time this day. This is one of the best days this year because I am about to discover and to put and practice something new that I have just learned in the middle of the of lack and due to my unpreparedness i am eager to show up with no intention to be indebted and i would like to be here to give a sucker punch to my own ignorance with this state of being a crackers or a fragmented person or a person who has a squeamish English and it's true that I am already with some gray coming in but I still have a cloud to grasp the round the bend situation in which I was found myself due to excessive coddling and because I felt canned in one single model that had me bound up in stagnancy. Okay, amigos, esta es una forma en que estoy aprendiendo a utilizar el inglés eh, con una una interesante, por decirlo así, una interesante aplicación. Espero que esté grabando esto. Y simple y sencillamente el viejo y venerable Excel. ¿Por qué no? La gente no lo usa, no le saca el producto. Yo le he sacado el producto en muchas materias. What I am telling is that I am showing a new way to to practice English with new words, uh, words that are, that are basically different from the usual 100 to 1000 basic words in English. And I think that after one month since I this project started here at the headquarters, this the outcomes are becoming more and more clear. And the, the voices of the language spoken here are finally receding and are to be booted, are to be booted. So one of my projects today, this is a minor project, is to speak in the same way that Mr. Donald Trump does. So, in order to start with this, I think I have found that Mr. Donald Trump speaks a very, very good English. And it's as a native speaker, he has plenty to tell us about uh, the proper way to use English in public. Okay, let us hear Mr. Donald Trump, but let us hear other pieces of this episode since the beginning. Madam Speaker, the President of the United States. Here comes the former President of the United States and his sympathizers along with him and accolading him for this event. Uh, I am thrilled to report to you tonight that our economy is the best it has ever been. Our military is completely rebuilt with its power, been unmatched anywhere in the world. And our borders are secure. Our families are flourishing. Our values are renewed. Our pride is restored. And for all of these reasons, I say, the people of our great country and to the members of Congress, the state of our union is 
stronger than ever before. If we hadn't reversed the failed economic policies of the previous administration, the world will not now be witnessing this great economic success. One of the biggest promises I made to the American people was to replace the disastrous NAFTA trade deal. You can see the expression of Ms. Pelosi in the background. Unfair trade is perhaps the single biggest reason that I decided to run for president. Following NAFTA's adoption, our nation lost one in four manufacturing jobs. Many politicians came and went pledging to chance or replace NAFTA only to do so, and then absolutely nothing happened. But unlike so many who came before me, I keep my pre promise, promises we did in jobs. Okay, ese tipo no importa. Bueno, <coughs> interesante este, este, este método de aprendizaje. This method of learning is really good as it, this is a single and basic report on how to improve your English. I am strongly recommending you hearing and shadowing with Mr. Donald Trump, former president of the United States, and probably the next president as well. Thank you and have a very, very good night. I will stay with Mr. Donald Trump trying to grasp fresh aired English.